guys, Eric Kyle here, publisher of Great Lakes Scuttlebutt Magazine, and I'm excited to be out of the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show right here in my favorite city on the planet, Fort Lauderdale, Florida. So while I'm here, I'm kind of wandering around. I'm looking for some new and exciting products to report to you guys on, and I found something that everybody's gonna want now. It's called Canberra Gel. I'm here with Joe Solly. Joe, how are you? How are you ya? doing? Good to see you, Eric. It is always a yeah, pleasure, my man. Excellent. We have known Canberra Gel for seven, eight years. Yeah. Something yeah. like that. Yeah, going on nine. Incredible relationship with you guys. Wonderful products. But you've got something new, my man. I do. A little different than what we had before. Yeah, tell me so about it. So all of our products have tea tree oil in it. Yes. And just getting away from airborne tea tree oil for a second. We've always done gels and sprays and wipes and soaps and fog. Um, but now we're going after the skin. Okay. Um, just a little bit of a background here. Myself and my chemist are cyclists. Okay. And we went out to invent a better chamois cream that had healing properties. Oh, that's and smart. And during our hobby time of making this product, uh -huh. we uncovered a really neat 21 ingredient formulation that we developed, and we called it Taint Paint. And this and has got the cam this has got the gel in it. It has the oils in it. The oils, so it okay. It has tea tree oil in it. Okay. Amongst twenty other ingredients. Gotcha. Okay. And those other ingredients are anti friction and anti glide, anti inflammatory type ingredients. And so we put these together to create a anti friction cream and we called it Taint Paint. Love it. Okay. And Taint Paint was designed for cycling. Okay. We tested it on professional cyclists yep. alike for about two and a half years. We had huge success. We decided to launch the brand mid-year this year. Okay. And it went over well and realized that there's a lot of chafing in other sports as well, mainly in running. Yeah. And as we uncovered the running sport, we realized it was a huge market. And we hired guys to go into that space and we came out with a more generic name called Canberra Anti-Friction Cream. Okay. Because not everybody loved taint pain as much as we did. Well, and they it was should. as funny as we did. Yeah, they we, should. Yeah, yeah they right. should. Well, let me, let me transition here yeah. because we're talking about cycling, we're talking about uh, running. I'm a boater. We're boaters, right? Excellent question. So, boaters, why do we need something like this? I answered it almost immediately when I answered, when I asked the question because I spend my entire day in the summer in my bathing suit. Board short chafing. I'm shorts, right? in, Anything. out of the water, Salt water fresh it's water, constant, shorts, yeah. yeah, and my kids have to have, you know, do the same thing, and by the end of the day, everybody's walking around like this, right, right. you know, and it gets so to be so it's rough. It's funny you say that, so we thought the same thing, what are we going to do with this in boating, right. and all of a sudden, divers came to us, they get chafing all over their neck from yeah. the dive suits, Yep. we have boaters, we have fishermen, people get board chafed, they get arm chafed, they get it from the salt water. Then policemen started buying from us because they get shaped from wearing the vests and the uniform. That makes sense. Firemen. Um, we have construction people that buy the tank paint for harness chafing. Yep. And then it just started going on and on. And then women with thigh chafing, yep. women with feet problems and high heels. Anywhere you have hot spots on your body, right. this is a great product. So there are a lot of products that are out there that are anti-chafing. This, from what I've heard, goes a little bit beyond just the anti-chafing. This actually goes into the healing element Correct. of what makes you chafe. Correct. So actually there's not a lot of products out there. That was what we kind of uncovered at first. Yeah. There's anti-glide properties out there that will help you put your wetsuit on or help you get into tight sports clothing. But no one was really putting healing properties in. And it's not yeah. just the anti-friction you need while you're doing the sport or the activity, but also afterwards you're sore and you need something to put on to stop that shape from coming a problem and heal, and heal it. So right. we put in vitamin B, vitamin E, lanolin, aloe vera, shea butter, tea tree oil, menthol, a lot of really great ingredients to help you heal and have great skin care during your sports and your activities. So I'm familiar with the gel, Canberra gel. Yep. Is this a jelly looking type product is it a paste type thing what's the consistency it is a okay cream okay. okay so put a little between two fingers just take a little out of there oh yeah 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 yeah. okay a little bit a lot and just go like this it has amazing glide properties so you can just and three four hours later because yeah. we when we cycle we go for four or five hours right. it has to still have those glide properties at the end of the ride like it right. did in the beginning 
and that's why it works so well. Golfers, I had three guys show up that couldn't finish a golf tournament in three days. They're doing 36 holes a day because they had butt chafing so bad they couldn't yeah. keep yeah. walking or they get, you know, rash from their shirts. Let me ask you this. Hands. I'm a golfer as well. Yeah. And my hands are like, uh, at the end of 18 holes. Would this help dry, with that? Yes, dry skin, any areas that you are have yeah. dry. Your okay. lips is a good lip balm. It's yeah. really, um, women use it as a post-shave cream. Great for getting rid of those razor bumps and having smoother legs. There's a lot of things That's you great can do idea. with Yeah, my yeah. daughter rows, yeah. and she has calluses all over her hands from rowing. I wouldn't this use it help. rowing while we're rowing because it's going to be no, slippery for course not. Post rowing, yeah, would yeah, be a great help thing. heal the calluses. Or inside gloves, if you're wearing gloves, you can put it on yeah. the material that is in the glove. I know? love so it. A lot, so of, lot of opportunities. This right. is really kind of uh, something that has never really been seen before that I know of. And for us boaters, we can think we're active people, not just out boating, but we're doing lots of things. Right. This would be a product that you want to have on your shelf. Price point wise, is it is it 30, 40 bucks for me to get a bottle of this? No, it's, What's it going to uh, cost? It's eleven ninety nine for a fifty gram jar. Really? Yep. Yeah, and nineteen ninety nine for the hundred gram jar. So very reasonable. Perfect. Great ingredients. Yeah. Where can I get it? Because you've convinced me. Not only do I have a lot of applications for right, it, right. But I want it. Where can I get it? Right now, it's a brand new product within the Canberra line card, but okay. we're offering to all of our distributors and okay. any of our dealers. CanberraGel.com. Go okay. there and buy it directly if you need to. But we'll have it out there. It's really new for us, but exciting. So we're heading out, out to the market now. Joe, Thanks we're so lot, excited Eric. for yeah. you. This Thank is you. fantastic. Appreciate Great thinking. It. Wonderful new product, guys. I like to call it Taint Paint because that's yeah. the best name for it. CanberraGel.com. Go there. Make sure that you pick some of this up immediately. Stocking stuffers. Yes. Fantastic stuff. Thanks so much for joining us today, guys. We'll see you out on the water. Bye, everybody.